Also tonight, people in a quiet neighborhood are on alert after a violent home invasion. Metro police want your help finding a man who forced his way into a home, especially after what he did to one of the two women who were home alone. Our Crime Beat reporter Steve Jefferson is on the city's northwest side to tell us what happened. That attack happened at a home here on Moeller Road. The suspect is still out there. Now people living in this area, like in the country farm subdivision, are hoping he's caught before someone else is attacked. I moved over here because it was quiet. Brooke Arnett Holman just learned about a violent home invasion in her neighborhood. She lived near West 56th and Moeller Road on Indy's northwest side, where she's always felt safe, but still takes heed to warnings from her family. I leave my garage open and my grandma came over the other day and she's like, um, you might want to keep, you know, keep this closed while you're home and things like that. Um, so that will definitely be a, a precaution that I take now. The home invasion robbery happened shortly after 9 o'clock Sunday night at a home on Moeller Road. Sources close to the investigation tell Eyewitness News the suspect attacked a 90-year-old woman and sexually assaulted a 60-year-old woman during the break-in. Brooke hopes someone is brave enough to help police find the suspect. If it were me, I would want somebody to come forward and let me know who harmed my family members. Police would like to hear from anyone who may have been in the area of the Aspen Chase at Eagle Creek Apartment Complex Sunday night. It does put some fear in you, like, oh my goodness, you know, um, especially in this area and then the age group of the, you know, the um, people that were assaulted is just beyond me. Brooke says her neighborhood is a crime watch area like the sign you see here. If you have any information on the attack, call Crime Stoppers at 317-262-TIPS. On the Crime Beat, I'm Steve Jefferson.